So, is he breaking off for the Embassy World title? Or can Jimmy save the match? <coughs> the winner to collect 150,000 pounds. The loser, 90,000. Caught it on the way back. Apologize to Stephen for the fluke. Has to take full advantage of it. Four. Five. We'll want to nudge the red away from the black spot here, I think. No? Well, the one Five. thing I didn't think about was him missing the black head. That uh, is unforgivable, really, but he is under pressure. Well, I'm sure every nerve in his body is completely knotted at the moment. One. Sad picture. Nine. Sixteen. This one up the side cushion. The rest 17. are all out in the open. <clears throat> Twenty-two. Twenty-three. There's the World Championship trophy that goes together with the one hundred and fifty thousand pounds. Twenty-nine. His mind must be on the three previous finals he's been into. They called him the Wonder Bairn of Scotland. He's certainly proving that here at the Crucible Theatre Sheffield this evening. Thirty-eight. Forty-five. Forty-six. And once again he passes the half-century. 
53. Always in my mind on these occasions, it seems a pity after such magical snooker... 54. ...that someone has to lose. And Jimmy, <coughs> who's been there three times before, will be the saddest person in Sheffield if Stephen continues at the table, as he's doing at the moment. Fifty-nine. Sixty. So just one more red required, and to really 66. put it beyond doubt, he needs a snooker already. He's had 67. three breaks over 50. This is the fourth, Ted. Two centuries. It really is savage scoring by this young man. And somehow I feel that Jimmy will come out of his chair purely and simply to shake the hands of his 23 year old opponent. 72. What a terrible shame. His millions of fans will be so disappointed. This was the year. For Jimmy White. 73. But one young man had different ideas. A young Scotsman by the name of Stephen Henry. He won this Embassy World title in 1990 and said he'd regain it. Ten 79. consecutive frames on the final night must be a record. Just the last red now. 86. 87. A sad picture. Ninety two. Ninety four. Ninety-seven. Stephen Hendry, world's number one star, completing ten frames. The capacity crowd here at the Crucible Theatre in Sheffield for this final. One hundred and six. As Stephen goes out in a blaze of glory. He becomes the 1992 Embassy World Champion for the second time as Jimmy steps forward to shake his hand. And what a miraculous performance by a 23-year-old boy from Scotland with victory at 18 frames to 14 after 10 consecutive victories in frames.